What's up, y'all? You know how it is. All day, you know it. But that's not why I came. It's not why I'm here. It's not why I'm doing a video. The video is, I know I meant to, I've been saying, I, I said I was going to do the 12 one CR D series and I really mean to dude I was I, everybody I, I really haven't been meaning to do it uh, I got hung up on some parts and then I tried to put the motor in the car I'll show videos the motor in the car come to find out the car only fits a B uh, H K or J uh, F H K J F you know you know what I'm saying? It only fits a swap, not B or D, you know. Um, unfortunately, the mount was cut. And I didn't know at the time because the way that the cam mount was cut, they cut it, <clears throat> the stock mount, um, they just cut the stock mount. Like, say, this is the long-ass stock mount. They just cut it in half and drilled the hole. Boom. And I thought it was the stock mount. You know, thought it was a regular-ass mount. And I'm come to find out, it's short for a... H or it's quite a bit short too, so it's like fuck. So H was already in it, so we're gonna do an H in the hash. So that's what this video is about. I mean, I didn't want to do an H, but y'all know how. I so went out. Got the pieces. This is the valve cover. Or the timing cover, sorry. Mount. Harness. Jumper harness. Oh. Oh, oh shit. Look at that bitch. Oh. That's the H Deuce Deuce. H Deuce Deuce in his boot. H hey, Deuce Deuce A, JBM, with the Skunk 2 Manny, Pro Manny, <clears throat> picked this shit up for a steal, like a dirt steal, uh, that's just a M, M2A4 transmission, M2A4 I think, or maybe I might have them backwards, I don't know, I don't know H series shit. So, trans, uh, what is it? M2A4, yeah, M2A4, there you go. So, uh, I got the trans, the motor, motor looks sweet. I mean, good to go. Gotta put the fucking timing cover on. I got the timing cover coming. I got a new uh, mount coming for the EG. I uh, have the alternator down there. Uh... Probably take this bracket off here. Uh, oh, no, that's the alternator bracket. Uh, so, alternator, that. Uh, the block looks good. Everything looks good. I mean, as far as I know, I put a new clutch on it. So, you can see the new clutch. And it's got a lightweight 11-pound Vedanza flywheel on it. So, uh, <clears throat> going H22A. I think this is the Euro version, homie said. It's got like 15 to 20 horsepower more. Don't quote me. I don't know H. I honestly don't know. So 15, 20 horsepower more. Y'all know we got the Beast K. You know what I mean? I'm still waiting to get her tuned. Nitrous system all, you know. But this is going to be the daily baby H22. 220 or 200. Yeah, 220 horsepower or 215, whatever. With a stock H transmission. So those of you who know H series, hit me up. Uh, let me know what y'all know. If you know anything, hit me. You know, let me know what you know. What I could do. What I need to do. As far as the EG swap, I got the harness here. Uh, the um, like a adapter harness or whatnot. Yeah, because it's gonna go off of that, and these are gonna go. Plugged into the back. I guess one of these is for the coolant temp sensor. The other one's for the oil pressure sensor. And I don't know. So I don't know. Y'all who've done it, 
anybody who done an H and the EG, uh, I got the OBD one. It's the OBD one harness here. The OBD one EG harness. Oh damn, I didn't even check if this was OBD one or OBD two. OBD1, nice, nice, nice. And you can tell about OBD1 in the circle. OBD2 is always the square. It's got like a square fucking uh, thing on it. I think I have one over here I can show you real quick. Yeah. See, OBD2, always a square looking thing right there. It's different from circle. The other one is circle. This one, this one is a circle. That's how you could tell OBD1 from OBD2. So. Just so y'all know, you know, those of you probably already know, like, you dumb motherfucker, like, what the fuck? We already know that shit. <laughs> those who don't know, you know, let everybody know. That's the, what the point of the channel is, to let everybody know if you want to ever know how to, you know, tell something. So, so OBD-1 plugs. We got the plugs here. We got the OBD-1 harness here. Again, you always tell the OBD-1 harness. It's got OBD-1 uh distributor on it already so obd1 everything already already plugged up already obd1 everything i gotta get a uh tps uh throttle precision sensor and uh some injectors uh now let me know if i can use stock injectors because i got stock um stock i think they're b series or d series i think d series and b series are the same so let me know if i can use those if i can't then um, I'll just go and try to go to the junkyard and pull some stock H um, injectors, just some old stock ass regular ones. Uh, I got the P13 ECU. It's in the house. Uh, I got pictures of it. I'll put pictures up and shit. Um, so I got everything, uh, almost everything ready. Uh, like I said, I got mount coming. Uh, rear bracket supposed to be here today. Uh, throttle body for a new I got the other manifold and shit the butterfly manifold or whatever but this one I didn't know this one was gonna you know be with it and all that shit so I got it for a steel last deal <clears throat> I'll put in the description y'all let me know what you think I got it for and I'll put and I'll put it in the description what you know no I won't even put it in the description y'all let me know what you think I got it for in the comments and uh, the winner uh Shit. I don't even know. I don't even know what I could do for the winner. I can send them something. I don't know. I got this extra. See, this one's got a skunk tooth throttle body on it. And it's already made it. So, I guess I could give the winner this skunk tooth. Uh, other skunk tooth throttle body I got. That I got that's. I don't even know if that's a 70 or what, but I'm not even gonna mess with it. So this is a 70 millimeter. It's all brand new. So y'all let me know uh, what you think I got the motor for. Let me know what you think I got the motor for. Since I got this one already, you let me know what you think I got the motor for down in the comments. And then uh, the winner, closest, closest person to, and uh, the winner, I'll, I'll ship that. We'll, I'll get you could DM me and uh, I'll get your address and whatnot, and then we'll go from there. And I'll, I'll ship that to you free of charge. So, thanks for you guys for watching. Um, I appreciate all of you, and I'm sorry I haven't been making videos, but see with this coronavirus stuff. And uh, I've before that, I told you guys I've been I've been busting my ass to really been lifting weights and 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 uh, accomplishing some powerlifting goals. So I started powerlifting. Um, I'm up to 500 pounds in a deadlift, um, uh, rack pull 600 pounds, um, bench press 235, and squat uh, today 335 is the best. So I got videos. I'll put videos up in the in the back. This is for the haters who don't believe in motherfucker. Who like, oh, you don't let that much. You a little skinny motherfucker. Yeah. Well, there's this thing called uh, wiry. Which means thinner motherfuckers who have longer torsos. I'm six foot and I'm pretty fucking strong myself. So you got a long torso and you're pretty strong already. It's got wiry strength, but I'm pretty fucking wire. I'm pretty strong. I'm just working on my bench press and my squat. But anyway, that ain't the, the point of the video. The winner will get the skunk two thing. 
I'm rambling on. I apologize. Hey, y'all stay safe with the coronavirus stuff. Thanks for watching. Comment down below what you think I got it for. Preach. Push, 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 there you go.